uh, when I first moved here to Stanford, it was 2015, and, and I started to notice that um, I have my Google Scholar alert. So when I, somebody cites one of my papers, I get an alert. And, and uh, every day I'd get one and be like, hey, um, Facebook or social media um, causes loneliness. And then literally the next day, there'd be an alert and be like, hey, Facebook actually reduces loneliness. It's like constant in the academic world where you were seeing you know, multiple kinds. And so I started to get a little bit frustrated that at the individual study level, we were seeing so much, so many differences. Um, but at the at the public discourse level, um, you know, so in, in the media, the prevailing narrative is that it's bad for you. And so, um, as somebody that like has studied social media for a long time, and I can see how it can be really valuable for people, the prevailing view of it's it's bad and it's addictive just didn't jive with sort of my understanding of what we were seeing in the research. So. I, want, I uh, decided to do a big meta-analysis, and if I ever um, tell you I'm going to do a meta-analysis again, please slap me and, and tell me not to do it. It's been a giant project with a lot of people helping and working on it, um, but finally glad to have it done.